Hi guys, Byron South with tip number 11, when to shoot. You know, I take a lot of new guys out calling and, and the tendency for a new guy when a coat shows up is they just kind of lose it and they want to start shooting immediately, start shooting at the coat. But if you'll just learn when to shoot, uh, there's a couple of things that, that I'll, I'll cover here. It tells you when to shoot, you'll kill a lot more coats. Um, everybody heard of, of the, the hard charger, the coat that just comes all the way to the call. Um, what you want when, when you get a hard charger is try to stop that coat for a standing shot. And a lot of times all you got to do is mute the call, turn the decoy off, or just simply woof. If he's coming real hard, you don't want to change anything, just woof like that. And a lot of times he'll throw on his brakes and give you a standing shot, but you need to be ready and shoot him at that point. The other kind of coats that come in, a lot of times a coat will get to a, a, a point where he'll what we call check up. He'll stop and look, make sure everything's right before he comes rushing in there. A lot of guys will want to shoot that coat right there. Um, and I'm not saying don't shoot that coat right there, but uh, look at his body language. If, is, he, is he focused on the call or is he focused on you? If he's focused on you, you should probably go ahead and shoot that coat at that point. Uh, if he's focused on the call, he's looking at that decoy. If his ears are back, if he's looking over his shoulder, that's an indicator that there's a second or third or fourth coat back there. So you really don't want to shoot that coat there because he's not alarmed, he's not spooked, he's going to come on a little closer and you may get that second or third coat in there. So when to shoot that coat, just read his body language and hope he'll come on in a little closer and give you a better shot, maybe also at a second and third coat. So uh, it's a lot of common sense, a lot of experience goes into uh, when to shoot, but I hope those tips help. That's tip number 11. Stand by for tip number 12.